accepted. Christ Jesus came into the world to save sinners. And I am the worst of them all. But God had mercy on me so that Christ Jesus could use me as a prime example to, of his great patience with even the worst of sinners. Then others will realize that they too can believe in him and receive eternal life. Now, all honor and glory to God forever and ever. He is the eternal king, the unseen one who never dies. He alone is God. Amen. 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 I bet Jesse Taylor can say that to you. Amen. And this song is about that as well. Years I spent in vanity and pride.
remember, yes, remember little devil, do you? <laughs> little devil broke in and just hold your hair all day long. <laughs> back when men used to slick their hair back. <laughs> and you'd comb it and you'd put that little flip in it. Real cream. Real cream. Yeah. It'd keep it there all day. <laughs> and all night. Until you washed it, you could just go like that and you just it. <laughs> Powerful thing. Yeah, we packed it so much, we patted it away. But we, we like, we like power. We, we want. There's a, a company called, um, where is it at? Walton's Products spent 12 years, and you, as you read, you read, you Google the most powerful thing. I Googled, what is the most powerful stuff? The most powerful stuff. What Walton's, W-A-L-T-O-N-S, Walton's product spent 12 years developing the most powerful barbecue rub. And their slogan is, it'll turn your cow into wow. <laughs> we like powerful stuff. OxyClean. OxyClean claims to remove any kind of stain. Even red Kool-Aid. Now, red Kool-Aid is probably one of the hardest things to get out. But you know, we just sang the song, There's Power in the Blood. And we sing the song, What Can Wash Away My Sins? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Kind of ironic, wouldn't you say, that the hardest color to get out is the color that God uses to cleanse us? The hardest, hardest color, to, the hardest thing to get rid of. That's what God uses, the red blood of Jesus Christ to cleanse us from all of our sins. Pretty amazing, isn't it? We are eternally separated, eternally separated from God when we sin. We're stained with a stain that won't come out. Nothing can take it away. Amen. Nothing that the world has will take that sin and then wash it away and clear it away. But the blood of Jesus Christ, the red, the hardest, the hardest stain to clean, cleans us from every sin we have, every sin that we've ever committed. We're, we 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 are here to start Colossians chapter 1. Something this has been on my had on my heart for some time. Colossians 1 20 and 22. And having made peace through the blood of his cross by him to reconcile all things unto himself. By him I say, whether they be things in earth or things in heaven. And you that were sometime alienated and enemies in your mind by wicked works, yet now hath he reconciled in the body of his flesh through death to present you holy and unblameable and repro reprovable in his sight. Amen. You know, think about that. Because of the cleansing of the blood of Jesus Christ, we can come <coughs> boldly to the throne of God. Right? Right to God the Creator. And he sees us blameless. Even though all that we've done, all the things Satan wants to remind you about, all the things in your past that, that Satan wants to remind you, oh, you did that. Oh, you're not going to be good enough. You're never going to be good enough. I had a man stand right on the other side of that wall one day and tell me God could never forgive me for all that I've done. But the blood of Jesus Christ washes away every sin to a point that God sees you unblameable, says, blameless. You've done absolutely nothing wrong, ever. Through the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. You know, we think about things that are powerful. Not only things that are physically powerful, but, but emotionally and, 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 and mentally powerful. When we have a, the Bible tells us if we have an offer with our brother that we ought to put, lay all our, our sacrifices aside and go take care of that before we bring an offering to the Lord. And, and I was thinking about that and thinking, you know how powerful it is to apologize to somebody face to face? A lot more powerful than a message or a letter or a card or a text message or something like that that doesn't really have any meaning. But when you can really go to someone and say, you know what, I'm sorry. There's power in there's power because that's the power of the blood of Jesus Christ that convicts us to do that. The power of the blood goes way beyond forgiving us for sins. The power of the blood of Jesus Christ is the most powerful thing that there ever has been or ever will be. Nothing can ever overcome the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. It's amazing the power that we receive 
through being sanctified by the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. We're coming into a, a season, the season of Easter, the season of the crucifixion of Jesus Christ and the burial and, and His resurrection. And when the blood was applied to every sinner, the blood of Jesus Christ, 2,018 years ago. And it's still just as powerful as it was on day one. It has not lost any power. It still does. It changes just as good then today as it did then. Even more so today. We're given power over the entire world through the blood of Jesus Christ. Go to Ephesians 2. 12 and 13. That at a time you were without Christ, being aliens from the commonwealth of Israel and strangers from the covenants of the promise, having no hope and without God in the world. <laughs> but now in Christ Jesus, ye who sometimes were far off are made nigh by the blood of Christ. Amen. Cast away, completely cast away from God. Never to be reconciled. There was no hope. There was no way. You were, we were all at one time lost in the world. Lost into a, a world of eternal damnation, eternal sacrifice, eternal, it's eternal torment. But through the blood of Jesus Christ, we were brought close to God. We were drawn in. He, 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 he relates us to sheep that recognize the shepherd's voice and we come. <laughs> And it's through the blood. It's through the power of the, the... The only thing that provides that is the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. The power. The most powerful thing. 